Hello there, Year 7. My name's Anna Norman and I'm Head of English here at Mill Bay Academy. Uh, I would like to welcome you uh, to the school. It's very sad that we haven't been able to meet you for the normal transition days, but we're very much looking forward to having you join us in September. Right everybody, this is Ella and Cameron and they're amazing Year 11s and they're going to tell you a little bit in a minute about English at the school. Um, first of all, Ella, how long have you been at the school? Four years. So since year yeah, seven? Since year seven. So Ella should be just about able to remember how you're feeling at the moment. Uh, Cam, how long have you been at school? I've been here like eight months-ish. Okay, so Cam joined us in year 10, so he's also a really good person to know what it feels like to be changing schools um, and to be able to give you a little bit of advice about English here. Okay, so let's talk to Ella first. Ella, how does English help with all of the subjects you study in school? So when you first come into year seven, you'll be doing all your subjects and learning new things in all of them. But English will like hold it all together. So when you're doing English, you're learning new things like how to write creatively, how to like extend your vocabulary and your knowledge. And you need that for all your other subjects in school. Thanks, Ella. OK, now we're going to talk to Cameron for a minute about how English might support him or benefit him outside of school. OK. So I'm a musician and a lot of the, the technical vocabulary and everything I learned from my lovely teacher, Anna. Uh, That's me. <laughs> it helps me to, uh, to, to write my lyrics. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Ella and Cameron are going to go back to their lesson now. Uh, next time you see them, you'll be here as a new member of Year 7. In a bit. You'll be fine in Year 7, guys. Good luck. Um, I'm sure that at home you are working hard and that you are looking forward to joining us in September. So let me tell you a little bit about what you'll be doing in September for English here at Millby Academy. We like to start Year 7 by looking at a whole novel. So your teacher will choose a whole novel to uh, study with you in your class, which will be themed around identity and what it means to be a young person growing up in the world. And then we'll move on in the second half term of Year 7 to look at a range of short stories, understanding and building on things that you've learned this year in your primary schools, ideas like characterisation, narrators, uh, symbolism and techniques that writers use to make their writing really successful and really engaging. Uh, as you travel through Year 7, you're going to be looking at a range of things. So there'll be poetry, there'll be short stories, there'll be creative writing, travel writing. And all of these skills will build as you move through Year 7, 8 and 9 until you begin your GCSE study in English Literature and English Language, which is mostly what I teach. So although you will see me around the school, uh, it's very unlikely that I will be in your lessons. You will have um, one of a couple of really amazing teachers. So your head of English for Year 7 and 8 will be Amy Manlo. Uh, sadly, she's not here today, so she can't meet you. You'll also have Andrew Spry and um, Vicky Meadows, and they make up our main Year 7 and Year 8 teaching team. So there'll be faces that are familiar to you very soon, I hope. Okay, here we've got Will and Billy, two more of our Year 11s, and I've just pulled them out of their lesson to come and talk to you a tiny bit about English here at the school. Um, so, guys, how would you characterise English at this school? What's, what's it been like studying English here? Uh, it's definitely been challenging, but when you get the grades back, uh, like doing the tests and stuff, it's definitely a lot more rewarding when you get the results that you want. What about you, Billy? Yeah, definitely. I feel like uh, it is hard work to get to where you need, but when you receive what like what you wanted, it's the, the hard work pays off without a doubt. Thank you. Um, and could you just tell Year 7 about where you are in your English courses at the moment? What what's your what are you about to do? Well, we're now studying Macbeth. Um, and last week we just uh, wrote an essay about um, about Macbeth, and then we're at like, near the end of year ten now, going into year eleven, and we're looking forward to our GCSEs. <laughs> um, and be under no illusions, year seven. The GCSEs uh, in English, literature, and language are really, really demanding. So the students here work very hard, 
um, but we do try and have quite a lot of fun in the English studios and classrooms. Um, and we try and have a curriculum for you that is really rich and is exciting and is full of the, some of the darker and more challenging texts that we're able to teach you from. We're really proud of our English department at Mill Bay Academy. In English, we expect people to work really hard and be very focused. And we, in return, we offer teachers who are absolute experts in their subject and who have to be able to share with you on all things English related. We very much look forward to seeing you in September. Have a lovely summer break. Bye-bye.